Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. I have been warned. Um, I'm probably not the first reactor to have said that. Maybe not even this week. Apparently, uh, these three sisters are blowing up. Um, I feel a little late to the game, actually, but I am very thankful to have discovered them when I did. Thank you again, Ron. Um, I really appreciate you for turning me on to this amazing band. Um, you know, I watched the TED Talk and I was just blown away, or the TEDx that had a couple of their songs interweaved. Um, they were younger at the time, and I think that I've done another video kind of from the past here, but I couldn't resist. You know, Enter Sandman by Metallica, a, um, a cover. So, um, we'll get right into it, but um, let's see if I have this right. Alejandra on bass, Pow on the drums, Paulina, but Pow, and then Danielle, Daniela um, on guitar. So, um, I really can't wait. This is going to be amazing. Shout out to Mexico. Let's go. Um, also, definitely go subscribe to their channel. Give them a thumbs up. I have the link in the description. And if you're new here, please consider subscribing to me, liking this, commenting. It does help this get out to more people who may have not um, been warned yet. So um, I also have some links in the description if you want to support me further. Okay, let's do this. There's the riff. Had to find a place to pause there. I think, you know, didn't want to interrupt the amazing buildup that is Enter Sandman. Um, I was especially fixated on Pow uh, because that, um, that drum, you know, solo is just so definitive and defining in, in the world of uh, in metal. Um, and I, I myself have um, gone down Metallica rabbit holes where watching people react to Metallica because, you know, people, it's, it's, it's just fun. Um, especially if you're not a huge metal fan. I'm not a huge metal fan, but um, really cool to see people covering this in such a way that stylistically just keeps it intact. But these are three teenage sisters at the time of filming this who um, are just crushing it. Absolutely crushing it. And I love to see it. I think this is going to inspire a whole new generation of people that um, otherwise may have, you know, not felt like they totally fit into that scene uh, that's so heavily male-dominated. And there's nothing wrong with that. Um, but this is cool. This is a, a very natural step. And um, I'm very... Um, it's heartwarming, basically. Um, now, Daniela's voice is definitely suiting this song. Sadly, I feel like it's being drowned out a little bit by the, the music here, uh, the, the drums and bass. Um, Maybe it's my sound, but I, I think it's just a little muffled. I'm definitely hearing it, but I wish it was a bit more prominent.
Daniela's voice is so suitable for this. I love her voice. Um, it's meant for rock, but it could be so many. I should have said it. It's not meant for rock, but it, it, she's can handle rock and roll, um, but also probably do a lot of softer songs too. Um, it's one of those transcendent voices that suits a lot of genres, which is amazing. Um, and then it's kind of cute. I'm watching Alejandra in the corner of my eye with that huge bass guitar. And it's just like, so funny. She's being like, uh, or bass, sorry. But she's just being, um, you know, it's like, she's handling it. Um, but it does give you a clue to what, you know, how young they were. They're so talented. <laughs> this um, part of the song here great job on the solo um, finger picking um, skills were on point for someone that's 16 you know that's a tough solo that's a tough solo I've looked up tabs for that I don't you know back when I was trying to learn guitar it's tough uh, and a lot of people sort of dumbed down dumbed down that section um, kept that completely intact awesome job awesome job this is great this is this is a great great cover. <laughs> Ah, oh, that is so refreshing to see three sisters just going at it like that. Jamming. This must be every parent's dream to watch their kids working together to produce something incredible. Uh, you know, you give your kid a guitar, you don't really expect them to do much with it. Um, or their first instrument. Like, I chose clarinet. What the hell were my parents thinking? Like, no offense to anyone that loves the clarinet, but uh, looking back, there were more versatile instruments, should I say that I could have picked up at a younger age. Um, sidetracked, but I'm like so impressed with them. Their ability to be cohesive as a unit, to give each other the space to really perform and not take over. You know, at a certain age, sometimes you're like wanting to be in charge, but no, they all obviously really respect each other and it really shows. And they did Metallica justice, which is, that's a feat in itself. I've seen Metallica live, they're incredible live and from the bottom of my heart, I think they did a good job with it. So, um, I have been warned, but feel free to keep warning me of new songs that I should uh, get into. I'm so done with the puns. I'm sorry, it's bad. Uh, but please, keep going. 
um, I need some guidance on where to start with them in terms of their uh, catalog here. So, um, yes, go subscribe to them. Make sure they get the support. Uh, but do hit like, comment, and subscribe to my channel. I do appreciate it quite a bit, and I do read every single comment. Um, and if you want to support me further, Patreon is the absolute best way to do that. I'll probably upload this early. Um, so, yeah, I'll see you in the next one. Take care.